So before we start, quick warning, sometimes I get a little bit excited about these home tours. I'm really excited about this one. Stay tuned. It's Amy with Heart and Home Orlando and welcome to my home. We are here for homes for the holidays. I'm kidding, this is not my home, but man, oh man, I wish it was. Serenity Now. So the name of this floor plan is Serenity. This is by MI Homes and we are here in a new community, a community that has just opened up and is selling like crazy. With limited lots in this community, if you think that this is a home that's gonna work for you, you do need to act quickly. This is a lovely community located right here in Winter Garden, one of the last new construction communities in this particular area. So we are at Sanctuary at Twin Waters. Again, this is MI Homes and this is their amazing Serenity floor plan model home. So this home is over 4,000 square feet, just under 4,100 square feet, and this model is to die for. So if you are looking for a really fun video tour, if you wanna take notes, if you wanna get some ideas, if you wanna move here, whatever it is, enjoy this video. Make sure you give me a call at 407-848-8042 after you watch this video so that we can start the process of actually finding you your home. But let's start this video tour. So the first thing you notice when you first come into this home is the magnificent entry and I will tell you that the interior design work up on the ceiling is spectacular that alone really really sells this home doesn't it it's absolutely beautiful so in this home again there's going to be lots of upgrades and options there's going to be a lot of interior design work that's not even an option for you when you build your home so when we go through this tour together look at the layout the flow where the rooms are situated See if that's what works for you because at its core, that's what you're buying is the floor plan, the flow, and the feel of the home. So huge, 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 magnificent entryway. So tucked over here at the front of the home is your first of the five bedrooms. Again, this model home shows five bedrooms. The master is on the first floor. This is not, however, the master. This is a guest room and it is a suite. So it is a nice, large and oversized bedroom with a nice big closet and it has its own private bathroom. What's really nice is that this is located right here at the front of the home so it's nice and private a bit secluded so it's a great spot if you're using it as a true guest room friends and family come to visit because of course when you live in Florida all sorts of friends and family suddenly emerge because they want to come take advantage of the beautiful place in which you live and not just the state that's beautiful but the house okay so continuing on if you see the staircase this staircase goes up and when we go upstairs you're actually gonna see that it has a second little level which is the bonus room space as well so over here is your formal dining room I love this entire flow of this home it is open and connected but still gives you your defined spaces this is a perfect example you can see the defined space you've got a gorgeous wall treatment there along that back wall you have these two pillars columns here the pass-through that really defines this space as your formal dining room but it is completely open and connected which is just spectacular huge amount of living space right here love the magnificent triple slider that looks out to the lake and that's one of the other things we want to talk about is that in this community this floor plan can be built on the lake it's a wider lot and the wider lot is necessary to accommodate the footprint of this home so you have also have to consider lot premiums because of course you're going to want that gorgeous lakefront view so back over here where you have your kitchen take a look at all of your counter cabinet space you've got a huge island space you've got obviously the pendants you've got your informal breakfast nook over there off to the side but a ton of cabinet and counter space the other thing you have is a gas community and that is something I just had clients yesterday really wanted a gas community and they're just not as readily available here in this area as you might think so take a look at this again look at design options I love the darker contrasting kind of a really steel dark gray 
tile that goes all the way up is just beautiful. So back over here, you have your informal dining area, your breakfast nook, your day-to-day -day dining. Now back in this direction is your actual laundry room. So your laundry room spot is really nice too, nice and big. And this is actually kind of an interesting little point. So this room back here, again, this is their model home. This is part of their sales center. So this is actually a three car tandem garage. Tandem means at the front, it's two garage bays, but there is a third garage bay that is in tandem that is set behind. And that is what this room is right here in real life. Here in the model home, it's, it's part of their sales center where they'll have their be meetings. But you can see a plenty of room, washer, dryer, plenty of room for cabinets and counters. Just spectacular. Remember, those are all options that you can add to the home when you purchase it. Okay, so back over here, you have your uh, your pool bath. So you have a, you can be a powder bath. You see that it actually has a shower stall right over there as well. If you want to have the full shower option. And then of course you have the door that's going to access outside. These lots are deep enough that you can see that you're going to have a lot of opportunity if you want for, um, for outdoor living space. They've actually created a nice pool area, covered lanai space. And when we go across the way. We're going to talk about something really kind of unique that you can add to the master bedroom to kind of accentuate this outdoor space. So again, take a look. You have this triple slider that goes all the way across. Really big and beautiful, nice area here. You've got lots of space, lots and lots and lots of space, lots of beautiful views of that water. So now back over here is where your master bedroom is. It's tucked away, it's kind of back here in the corner. Also really nice, I love this. It's almost like a door within a door. So you have the pass through and then you have an angular double door here that takes you into the master bedroom. So you don't have a direct eye shot of the master bedroom. Another one of the really smart designs here with this particular floor plan. It's not like if the door is open you can see smack dab into the bed. Kind of weird, right? This is perfect because you can see you enter in one way and then you have the doors at the angle. It's really, really smart design. So huge master bedroom and look at the design. Oh my goodness. Talk about beam work and some of the woodwork that they have done in this for interior design purposes. Spectacular. We really need to do a video on the, on the uh, interior design team. Um, if you would like to have one of those videos, you just let me know here in the comments and I will see if we can work that out because how much fun would that be to talk to one of the interior designers? All right. So the master bath bathroom. Again, huge. Look at the amount of space in here. It's enormous. So you have big, huge, separate his and her vanities. You have a freestanding tub, oversized frameless shower. You've got linen closet, privacy door for the toilet, and a huge master closet as well. So there is a lot of space. This is not a tiny master bath where you're going to be bumping into each other as you're getting dressed, getting ready for work or whatever your day may bring. This is really a big oversized, super wide um, master bed or uh, master bathroom. The closet itself also huge. You can see here they've even created the extra little island here in the middle. Lots of places to hang um, clothes, cabinet shelves, drawers ton of space in here. All right. So now upstairs we have some more bedrooms and a really cool fun zone. So I'm going to go take a breath and I'll meet you upstairs. Oh, but before we go, there was something I wanted to mention as a structural option here with this master bedroom. So what's really cool about this is that there's a structural option that you can actually push this wall back a little bit. By pushing that wall back, you create an additional sitting area here within the master and you can extend that lanai a little bit further and you could create doors from that sitting area of the master out to the extended lanai. Absolutely spectacular and with a lakefront view like that, it might be an option you want to choose. Okay, now I'm going upstairs. See you there in a minute. So upstairs, you're going to have three more bedrooms and this really cool fun zone. So not only do you have one set of stairs, but you have a short little landing and then you have four more stairs that take you up to your game room area. So we're going to take a quick look at this and then we're going to finish up out here because I also want to show you the balcony, which we'll do at the end of the video. So up here in this fun zone, your flex room, your loft area, your bonus room, whatever you want to refer to this room as, it is just totally awesome. You have a lot of square footage. Take a look at what they've done here staging wise. You've added kind of the wet bar, little mini kitchenette area. 
great spot you could put your little mini fridge or a wine fridge in here cabinets and counters if you want your microwave coffee machine popcorn popper whatever it is you want you can create this little zone in here plenty of room for chairs sectionals pool table foosball whatever it is you want to make this room you can do that now there is a balcony out there but we're going to come back and look at the balcony and finish the video out there so over here you have three bedrooms the one that's tucked back here at the end of the hallway so we just came in the front door up the stairs and directly um, back to the right looking out at that gorgeous water view this is a really oversized bedroom with its own private bathroom and that's important to note because because this truly is, look at the space. From corner to corner, this is an incredible amount of space in this bedroom. You can see just by the way they have it staged, they have a full-size bed, two nightstands, you have the dresser, you also still have a little sofa space. You've got plenty of room in here. So thinking about it for practical purposes, purposes for you and your family this might be a room where you also want to have some desk desk space or a work zone for your kids for homework but there's a ton of square footage in this room to do that by the way decorating idea this is adorable I love this angled wall and what a spectacular way to really make that pop and to be useful in your day-to-day -day life so this also has a nice um, private bathroom so you have a full tub shower combo you have your single sink cabinet counter mirror and you have your toilet and then you have a nice big walk-in closet as well so this bedroom is really nice again thinking about you and your family who would be living here how would you make this particular room work who's raising their hand watching the video right now going that's my room oh well, maybe this isn't your room but maybe this one is so this one is cool okay I love this right here this if I could hug it I want this in my homes I don't know who does your interior design but it is absolutely off the charts, incredible, creative, unique, and just so awesome. This is such a smart idea. So if you look at this, sometimes when the, when the homes are designed, you have these little, these little kind of niches, these little nooks, these kind of little accents with walls because maybe there's the AC unit over there, but you have these kind of, um, you might say challenging. Clearly this is not challenging. Clearly this was just a masterpiece in the making because this is incredible. How smart to create shelving around that little area to make that space function and to be an absolute pop of art that's just spectacular clearly I love it okay but at its core <laughs> it's a bedroom um, now by the way that shelving stuff does not come included in the home okay so we have to backtrack that a little bit but I think that is really awesome and you have a nice big walk-in closet there as well so remember this bedroom down on this side of the hall big bedroom had its own private bathroom this one spectacular wall thing that doesn't come with the home so you have to get that done after the fact over here you're gonna have a nice big bathroom as well I really like this bathroom too you have a nice um, elongated bathroom so you have plenty of cabinet and counter um, and your vanity area and then of course you have the tub shower combo and you also have the toilet now if you're looking for design ideas I just like to point this out this is a different type of tile so this is kind of a more matte kind of a plank tile that's more of a 12 by 24 and then this one looks like it's more of a like maybe like an 8 by 24 and it's kind of got like a glossy finish it's kind of like a, a glass tile it's very cool so that kind of contrast really really cool design and then back over here you're going to have your other bedroom which is your fifth bedroom of the home because remember downstairs you had the suite on the first floor at the front of the home the master bedroom up here you had one two and this is now the final bedroom here and this one this one is located at the front of the home Home. again plenty of room they've got a full-size bed two nightstands you've got the dresser you have a nice big walk-in closet and of course back to my favorite part you have this really cool unique game room area now this particular elevation provides you an option to add um, a balcony here on the back of the home you don't always have options for every floor plan with every builder not not the, uh, the option isn't there all the time but in this particular floor plan this elevation you do have the opportunity to look at this balcony this is spectacular so my friends this is what you are looking at you have a lovely lake right there you have a lot of green space throughout the community and in this model home this is a great representation of what you can do with your outdoor space 
you can create that pool area, your green space, you can add a summer kitchen. Really the, the options are limitless when it comes to your outdoor living space. Because we live in Florida, there are so many creative and unique designs to work with the layout and the view of your home. In this case, you certainly want to accentuate that gorgeous lake view. All right, so remember, the next thing that you need to do after watching this video is to call me at 407-848-8042. Remember, I do not represent the builder. I'm a realtor here working really hard trying to provide this information to you through the magic of YouTube so that you, wherever you are, um, if you're freezing cold, up north or if you're in another country that you can actually be here with me for a few minutes every day and walk through these home tours but the best thing that you can do if you are seriously considering moving here is calling me so that we can talk personally and we can actually go through these communities these builders these floor plans and find the ones that actually work best for you and what you're looking for more than anything though I want to appreciate you and let you know how much I thank you for watching this YouTube channel please subscribe to it if you haven't already if you have thank you for the rest of you again thank you so much for watching I hope you have enjoyed our homes for the holidays. I'll see you next time in the next video. Have a great day, everybody, and happy house hunting.